There's a sort of a sub thing about dealing with a lefty sword and board. There's some folks who like to spin. If you're going to spin on a left-handed person, you're going to have to modify your spin in some form or fashion. Because <laughs> doing a right-handed spin on a left-handed person right there. automatically predisposes you. It's possible to do it, but it automatically predisposes you to getting hit. You're handing them your back. At, uh, you know, most of the time, the lefty will just block it. They'll drop your thing and hit you, and they won't even think twice about it. Worst case scenario is they'll just take a step back, and there's not much you can do about it, except you know, be glad that he didn't do anything more. So, if you're going to, if you're going to spin on a lefty, you have to get in closer. And you've got to put your shield up. You got to put your, you know, you got to come in closer, and you've got to put your shield in such a way is that their sword is bound down. You've got to get their sword isolated. You got, I'm trying to, spinning ain't my forte, so oh, come here. Shot. Show me a spin where you... That's how it would go. Yeah. That's, so, that's what I do. But, but still, back right there. Yeah. It's the only real time that I can get it off against a lefty is if they're already into a shot, mm -hmm. because you can time it so that they're out of the range, they're coming back. Whatever, you can put the board in the way at the first place, jam them up, get the shot and get out of the way. That's, that's the only time I can really do it. Yeah, just, and for the most part, you're not going to be uh, with a left-handed person getting away with the, you know, the usual side pop, because that's their shield side. So you might have to uh, switch it around. Or, uh, switch it to or, 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 like, let's say he's the left-handed person. You, you might, uh, you might have to get in closer. You might have to lead with your shield more. But uh, even then, it's kind of problematic. Yeah, I mean, in general, you just don't. But if you do, you've got to either be very quick about it, or you've got to isolate their weapon so you can at least get out in one piece if it doesn't work. It's almost better to just to uh, come in and do a wrap. Come in and do a wrap on their weak side. Just so you, you basically fake that. Right yeah. yeah. The, left, the lefty will be a lot more vulnerable to that than they will to a fancy spin, especially if they've got a bigger shield than mine. <laughs> Dealing with a left-handed fighter, single sword, only with bigger, longer holes. It's um the the. the no, well, if, as opposed to like right-handed people fighting right-handed people, you're you're going to you're you're trying to fight past someone's guard. But when you're fighting against a lefty, you're already vulnerable from the get-go. So, in, 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 when you're fighting with a right-handed person versus a left-handed person, you've got to be wary of your arm. You you have to be in control of the soft of that vulnerable spot here. Whoever, generally speaking, whoever's got control of that spot against a left-handed fighter, and there's some left-hand, there's some great, there's some pole arm classes that'll teach you a lot more detail. But this is just the basics. If you can, whoever's got control of that inside area there, it's generally going to win the fight. So there's a lot more footwork involved, and there's a lot more keeping somebody out of that area. Keeping your shoulders straight. Yep, you got to keep your shoulders straight. You got to keep. Uh, that arm away. Fighting's a little more, there's more distance and because you're trying to get in there without getting got. And, you know, as opposed to the right-handed thing where, you know, okay. Make sense?
speak, you, know, you go up in there, somebody's ready, a uh, uh, right-handed person's ready for this, and you come in and flip it around. Just a neat little asshole maneuver, some left. Leaving them do. going, how did it bend like that? Yeah. <laughs> and then they go, oh, you shouldn't go left. I'm pretty sure around you go back. Yeah. yeah. Well, that was, that was mostly <laughs> the thing I kept hearing when you were freaking running the, uh, what's it, the square pitch style one, and you got the 49 in a row. Yeah. So, like, you get to the end of the line, they're like, Open if you got him. <laughs> and left handed pull arm versus right handed shield. Another big one. Oh, you're not going to do it on you? No. Scoop your right there. Hi. Show. Oh. And I'm kind fighting a right handed person. Yeah. Another neat one when you're fighting a right handed person, you fake down there. And as you come oh, in with the fake, you bring it around and you pop it back on their shoulder. When you bring it, when you pop oh. it back down, so. <laughs> 